can't tell from the front because it's a normal card, but look at the back. Go ahead and turn it over. There's no way. There's no way. <laughs> There's no fucking way. Ain't no way. There's no way. There just there is. There is. I know I'm not back in boot camp, but I just I had to yell. Yeah. <laughs> I don't know if you've ever held a brainwave deck before, but I can assure you, if you have, your brainwave deck can't do this. So here's what happens. You ask the spectator to think of a randomly shuffled deck of cards while having them think of one card and lock it in their mind. You got one in mind. You're just thinking, you're just thinking about one card right now, right? And remember, like I said, one of these cards is gonna be completely different than the rest of the deck, right? And we're gonna bring that imagination to life. Without touching the deck or asking any questions, the spectator removes the card from the deck. Little do they know, it's the only odd back card in the entire deck. Okay. Yeah. And place this right here momentarily. We're gonna get back to it, right? Now look, I want you to take this pack here. Take it. Spread through quick. Spread through quick. Spread, 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 spread. Right. They're, they're all the same, obviously, right? Yeah. Spread, 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 right. But look, I told you to imagine one of these cards and one of these cards only will be completely different. Do you see the difference in that card? You see, probably not, because you're not looking at it from the right angle, right? That's the front of the card. Yeah, yeah. This is the back of these cards, and this. Is the back of that card. <laughs> <laughs> That's, That's so cool! <laughs> Created by Alan Garcia, and I'm sure Brainwave Redux will be your new favorite go to version of the Brainwave. So like if I were to take a, an invisible card, what, what card do you see? Take your time. The immediate to mind would be, the, you know, Ace of Spades. Ace of Spades. Ace of Spades. <laughs> That's what Matt said. I don't That's want you to be, I, I don't want you to be influenced. So I don't want you to be influenced. Like everybody, you're gonna yeah, but there's, there's 51 other have. options. Oh, yeah. Remember, 51 yeah. other options, right? What card do you see? I'm going to go with the Four of Clubs. The Four of Clubs. Right? Now listen. The ace of spades is so The ace of spades is so predictable. In fact, Matt said that earlier. That's exactly what I said. That's what I thought. That's what I said. You said you said something completely random and different that nobody could have imagined that you thought about that, right? I want you to imagine that that one card is different from all the rest. Right? Now listen, before we started, this box of cards was sitting here. I'm going to take this out. I'm going to hand it to you. I want you to spread through and stop when you find the four of clubs. Right there. Yep, right there, right there. Look, I'm going to take this. I'm going to take this. We'll take the rest of the pack. Look, look. Spread through quickly. Just spread through. Spread through. Quick, 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 quick. Spread, spread, spread. They're all, they're all, they're all, they're all, they're all red, red bicycle cards, right? But I told you to imagine one of these cards was different than the rest. This is all based in your imagination. Now, although all these cards are all red cards, the one card that you merely imagined was lonely blue here in the entire deck. <laughs> you say, God damn it? Please call me Derek. Derek? Awesome. Awesome, man.